Hi, hi. Oh, I just realized I don't have the... Well, I think that's fine. Uh, add it. Browser source. Hello. Nah, no tech problems. I was just a bit... Uh, just trying to find some stuff. Let me shrink this down a bit, actually, so you guys can actually see me a bit better. <sighs> now I'm just a bit, like, spaced out at the moment. I don't know why. Yeah, how you doing? How you doing? Got 10 centimeters snow today. Looking forward to tomorrow. Ooh. Yeah, nah, it's nothing bad. I'm just a bit like... Eh. Because I've been doing some very head-empty uh, gacha grinding, so that's kind of been a bit like... Ugh. And I've also been working on this drawing. Uh, and yeah, so far I've done a fair bit. You know? <laughs> it's not even just the gacha, I'm just... Uh... It's that plus the cold, because like, it's so cold my fingertips like actually physically hurt, it's really bad. Hello Finn, hi hi. Right, time for some Undertale music. Toes and fingers freezing, yeah. I've not, nah, my toes luckily no because I have socks on. And my second final of the day at 7.30. Ooh, good luck. You can do this. I believe in you. I don't know if your popsicles same, Yeti. Like, here is like minus one or something. It's, but it's still like so cold because the air just sticks to you and it, free it hurts pretty much. It's minus nine E. Yeah, you guys are a lot more northern, so yeah. And playing Undertale has just kind of revitalized that part of me of when I played it uh, when it first came out of just how much I loved the music and how like oh I was obsessed with like the fan art and like the fan covers of songs it was all so good I miss that time but also I partially don't because the fandom was also like super toxic. And also kind of cringe. Yeah, early Undertale fandom was something else. Like it was either, you were either on like the, the nice side where you get like all the cute fan art, all the cool song covers, or you're on the, the alternate universe side where it was just absolutely horrible to be. And I, I think I avoided that side. How did I colour her hair? I see, I see. Uh, that and then... Got a paddle done. Nice. Uh, that was also the uh, other drawing. One sad thing. Oh. There we go. That helps very much. I 
Couldn't bully the artist with money this time. Oof. What, you don't- they don't have like a, a Kofi you can throw money at them with? It's like the best bit. <sighs> Lazy! Hi, hi! Doesn't feel the same. Aw. Yeah, I, I get that. Oh, there it is. I found the, the, the really cool cover. I hope... Oh. Thing is, I don't know if you guys are familiar with Milky Chan. Uh, they do a ton of, like covers of um anime intros or vocaloid songs i feel like they really did the song justice mm. i mean if that's where you get your serotonin uh it depends because i found them through undertale and then i listened to a lot of their stuff afterwards it's it's such a good song it's such a good uh, rendition of an already amazing song. Yeah, as I was saying, if that's where you get your serotonin from, find an artist who you can throw money at and get them to draw your emotes. Or if you're stubborn enough, you can just throw, find a way to throw money at them. Mail the money to them, yes. <laughs> Show up their house, yeah, exactly. Prime with them exactly. Oh, thank you for that, lazy. Our <laughs> orchestra by billboards, etc. Exactly. I think it's probably because there's no shine to it that looks weird. Ooh. <laughs> Incarnate, well, I'm... Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh. Xenoblade. I'm actually really loving how this illustration is coming along. Like, I've got the I've got the the cape here and ah, oh, I I really like it. So I'm on episode seven, uh, 37 of Golden Wind. 
hate JoJo's for constantly killing half the cast. Yeah, I don't watch JoJo. I'm sorry. How's your guys' day been? I keep forgetting to ask, but I probably should because you guys have some adventures. <laughs> Always wants to live like a hobby, like in the Shire. Got to I like a man at work. Let's go. The other did a flip in the snow. What the fuck? So you almost did what? Am I right? There we go. Because it looks on ice. Oh, okay. final exam earlier today that I'm pretty sure I did very very well on. Let's go! We love doing well on exams. I I wish you all the best on your next one. I'm worried about this calculus exam though because that's where things could go horribly wrong if I don't prepare properly. Yee, yeah, that's typically the Good luck. Oh, that doesn't look half bad. Also, I, mm, I don't think I should have this. No, not that. This. Yeah, it looks better without that. <laughs> Yeah, I I believe that you can do it, Finn. Oh, that's the wrong layer. That's per usual. There we go. I think my day has been like uneventful as always. We got like no snow still, <laughs> which is probably for the best considering I am going away in a few days and I don't want the roads to be too horrendous for my friends to drive on. Uh, wonder who that loser was who decided running in a park through snow and ice was a good idea than stopping only to realize their legs aren't moving and their body isn't. Uh, I give you my snow ticket all. Nah, I think we're good without. 
I, want, I, I like to be able to go places every once in a while because, fun fact, I can't remember the last time I went outside. I know it's a funny hee hee to say that I, uh, hee hee, I don't go outside and touch grass, I, but I actually don't touch grass. It's, it's not good. Ow. Are you? Okay, so it's on the ice and nearly did a flop. This was just an artist? Yeah. I mean, that mainly because it's so cold here, I don't want to risk getting sick right before my trip, and my sister might have COVID. So I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah, stay away from me. Don't come near me. Oh my god. Like, I'm doing everything to not be near her because I don't want to get COVID right before my trip. Uh, I'm still hoping to get sick. Good luck, Yeti. You can do this. Probably not something I should be wishing you good luck on, but you you seem to want it. Ow! This grass sounds like an allergen. I didn't feel like vomiting on Monday. E. I mean, when you vomit, that's actually when you win. <sighs> Swallows it down like a champ, don't. I mean, to be fair, that's not very healthy because if you don't. Uh, swallow it properly and it, it can go back in your lungs and you can suffocate and die. To know the truth Now that you're gone Yet your love is still Embracing me I need you with me I abandoned draw, I am now paint gang Woo! Let's go! Oh, I... No, oh, I fucked this I'm a fucking clown, oh god, uh... I abandoned the stream. I now, I am now MGR okay. <laughs> Happy luck, he's lazy. Time to bludge. Uh, sliding through my job till I can clock out and paint. Whoa! I feel like that's just the daily grind, honestly. Good luck, lazy. I see you smile, pretending everything is alright. Congrats on 500. Thank you! I'm so happy we actually hit the goal. It's. Right, for we have to travel and thank you, Yeti. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you and everyone else who also donated. Absolute legends. Mm -hmm. uh, I am still gonna keep uh, like an open goal until the end of Thankmas. So. 
I don't know when it ends, but yeah. sneeze on coming oh god Oof. oh please sneeze no okay fuck you Knock, knock, who's there? Ach. Ach, who? <laughs> yeah, I saw that coming. Also, something I didn't realize till it was brought up to me is the fact that I am somehow a 196 followers or some shit. And I don't know when that happened. Like, last I checked, I think I was like at 160 or 170. I don't... Yeah! It's, it's been like six months and I'm already like, oh god, we've already almost hit 300. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm oh I'm baffled. I am I am shocked. I am speedless. <laughs> I do wanna try hit three hundred uh on Twit well both really. I mean no twit Twitter, I've already hit three hundred. Twitch, I am at one ninety six at the moment. So I'm close to 200. And yeah, my, oh, what, went back to 195, but going strong. Uh, okay. Yeah, that happens. Yeah, my main aim is hopefully by the end of the year to hit uh, 200 followers. Because if I can do that, then, oh god, I'll be very, very happy. I don't know why, but I'm yawning a lot. That worries me because I have been sleeping. I mean, to be fair, I might have a chance if I if I played some Valo, I'd have maybe a chance of hitting one ninety five, uh, two hundred pretty fast. Because a lot of people will like follow you, but like never watch you. That's just, that's just how it goes. But it feels cheap to do that, you know?
Okay, there we go. This color is popping. That is absolutely button. Oh, good night uh, and have a good one. Good night, Yeti. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it as always. Ow. They're actually waiting for GBF content. They're probably gonna... I mean, we've got a thing. We've got uh the live stream coming soon so oh oh god why is my internet please stop cease please Let me show my current weapon. Yeah, oh yeah, I must, I must see. Cause your work in progress is absolute bangers. I'll throw in a study from yesterday too. Ooh, interesting. I shall see. Also, I like the other piece that you posted earlier. I... Oh, it's so good. Yo, what the fuck? Oh my god. Hello? Wow, that stuff's so good. Hold on, let me share. Uh, control B. What the fuck? Too bad you don't play Apex the Skull Dude as an Apex character. Ah, this is so good. I love this so much. Yeah. The, 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 the brush. The brush techniques. Oh my god. I am envious. And your other one is also looking absolutely amazing, my god. And your brush is nice. That was somehow free. Oh, well, okay. I mean, is that it's free? It's free. Unless your brain cells not work, you won't do. Uh, I can't help you there. <laughs> thank, uh, thank you, Gumroad Cross, for the brushes. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like anything more. Maybe I just need to bring it up a bit. No, oh, because then you can't even tell it's there. I'll do uh, this.
That works. Yeah, that works. I like that very much. I should take a look on Gumroad, just like what is there, because I feel like I never look. Just realized I have a 22 50 euros sitting in my CS can. I euros are just cases. Oh, interesting. Okay, this is looking amazing, I, in my personal opinion. What to work on next? What to work on next? I should probably draw in the throne at some point, but I can't be bothered. Uh, this is my D and D character. Uh, she's the one from this drawing here. Her. That's my character, and that is uh, Abby's character. And fun fact, they are indeed married. This fabric chair folds. Do they look good? Because... <laughs> oh, okay, I'll take that as a W. Because, uh, fun fact, this thing is meant to be made of uh, gold. Not only that, it's attached to her skin. So that's fun. No, I think I mentioned it yesterday on a stream that I rated, but I can only do this because yeah, it's literally just a golden cape that's attached to her. Like it's attached to her, it's fused to her skin and then falls down like a cape. And um, why does my connection keep going in the red? It should be fine. As I was saying, um. Yeah, I was saying on the oh God, the raid yesterday um, that, yeah, I, I've just been drawing gold for so long. I'm kind of just accustomed to it. And yeah, I really am. I love gold. I love, like, drawing gold. Like, you look at uh, this drawing. Oops. Like, this drawing... You look at like the armor, the rings, all that. This bit that was so fun. And this. It's more metallic practice. I I uh, look towards games like Fire Emblem uh, because a, like, a lot of that has armor and from that I can actually like learn from there. Or looking at uh, Mushimaro's work because they also do like a lot of armor in theirs and intricate designs and there I can like pick up. I think this one I actually took some inspiration from uh, one of their drawings. Mm, yeah, it actually turned out pretty well. So yeah, I've kind of come to learn met uh, like metallic especially like with this i'm really proud of this it's a picture i need to figure out fun fact i use it's meant to be like an oil painting brush uh an oil painting and i used an oil brush for it still need to adjust it though but you yeah. using ai for post reference don't no, no no i don't blame you for that honestly i feel like that's the best way to use ai like, it's how artists can actually use it. It's scarily good. I use, like, an earlier version of Dali. Uh, I used, like, an earlier version where it was, like, very vague poses. And I remember I actually used it. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, find the one that I did. Uh, use. 
and you guys might, uh, I don't know if you recognize it, but you might do. Uh, this one. So I made a drawing, literally just based off of that one, I made this drawing. It's very... It's vague, but just enough that I can make something out of it. Stuff like that is fine to be honest. It's using AI as a supplement to creativity instead of a replacement. Using it for inspiration and assistance instead of just having the robot do everything instead. Exactly, that's how I want, how I also want AI to be used. More as a, more as a tool over the, the whole process. And like, once again, one of my other drawings, uh, this one. Where is P? Ah. Like you can see, I vaguely got a pose from here. I it's very very vague. You can see the shapes, but it gave me like a general pose I can use, and I used that and created it. However, it didn't complete the whole process for me. I still had to figure out the lighting the the shape of everything i actually had to draw in all of her armor it's merely just helping me come up with inspiration nothing more what the fuck that's ai that's terrifying Bruh, what the fuck? This is the same thing that can't draw hands. Haha. <laughs> yeah, because, no, like, back when I generated uh, these, this was all the way back in June. Uh, I told you I was in that AI studio this past semester. I don't think you did. Either that or you didn't, and I just don't remember. Still, that's baffling. Like, mine was just like vague poses. It still, it still can't draw hands. I got another version of the character that had six fingers. <laughs> I feel like it's. Oh, God. Once again, it's cool that they can do this, but I don't give a shit uh, about the art itself because it's made by a robot that doesn't have feelings. Exactly. Let me find... Because I have sketches that have more emotion than any... Okay, maybe I can't show that one. <laughs> Never mind, I can't show that. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I saw this Twitter thread a few days ago and how to spot AI art and it had three posts uh, saying look at the hand. It was so funny. Yeah, typically with AI art, you look at the hand, you look at the hands, you look at the ends of the hair. And yeah, within there, you will, with it, those two things will definitely like show it you. Your smart AI crops the hands out. You, yeah, you look at like AI that like, doesn't show the hands and it's, that's where it gets like really muddy but then after that it's just a case of look at like the background can also tell you because sometimes the background just it really gives it away or like how does the character fit into the background because it feels like they don't know what layering is <laughs> like there's no such thing as layers it just shoves it all together and it smudges like it cuts and smudges into the actual drawing yeah you can still tell what's ai
Yeah, also, I don't know if you guys saw, but I am really, really proud of these eyes because, oh my god, I have i don't think I've drawn anything this good in terms of eyes. Uh, I think there's something to be said about the AI being given improper training data because hands are hard to draw, so it's it'll be given an imperfect hands and it'll assume that that's just how it'll be. Mm -hmm. That plus just hands in itself is just so complex. Like, I feel like it would be the same with feet. Ask an AI to draw feet and there's gonna be maybe six or seven toes. And I feel like that's why you don't see much feet art from AI, uh, because they're probably more awful looking than hands. But also, I can say with confidence, um, even big companies don't know how to draw feet. There was a there was a thing back during this year's summer this year, where uh, in Grand Blue, <laughs> in Grand Blue they they uh, released like an extra pose for one of the characters, and they had her feet on backwards. And they did, I think it was either this year or last year, they did this not with one character, I think they did it with two. I think they did it with, um, uh, Kumbira. Kumbira had backwards feet, I think. Someone had backwards feet and someone had two left feet. <laughs> it was so bad! <laughs> it was so good, but it was so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it was amazing. Oh. So yeah, even even people. Remember they changed from the event managers with C H. Oh, I don't remember that, but yeah, side games, like. It goes to show even human error plays a big part. Because <laughs> they were uh, they were cross swords, they put the swords on the wrong side. Uh, honestly, I think that the rise of AI might end up resulting in greater prominence of wacky art styles that are harder to replace and harder to use as AI training data. The unfortunate thing is that simply won't happen because people are able to take those individual like styles, shove them into an AI and create a style simply from that. That's the unfortunate thing is that people will sample smaller and smaller data sets in order to create a more close recreation. So unfortunately, I don't think it will be like that. But if you keep using stable like base stable diffusion, which just samples from Danboru, then yeah, maybe. But like, Ugh. It w oh yeah, it'd definitely be cool, but unfortunately it just won't work because you look at stuff like Sam Does Sexy, which is um, an AI dedicated to mimicking the art style of Sam Does Art and basically used to like mock and bully him and the fact that he can't do anything about it. It's unfortunate, but that's just how it is. It's disgusting. And it's why I don't think I'll ever be able to fully support AI art until there's like a, a solution to this stuff. Do you see the new upcoming photo editing AI? I don't think I did. Was it that whole big thing that influencers uh, were posting about? That was also like sourcing from I think it was Stable Diffusion? Like all the influencers post on one day and then like throughout all the images you could see like vague bits of people's um like signatures, artist signatures. Or am I thinking of something else? It's not like a image generating AI at all. Yeah no, I'm I'm lost then. <laughs> Uh, 
it's like the false editing like basically everything i've seen about ai makes me not want to use it because it's just enabling horrible people to be horrible more effectively fuck that pretty much because like it i feel like the people who use ai art are either the people who are like uh who are under artists uh photos saying can you draw me can you can you can you draw me can you draw me for free can you can you draw me or it's ai bros who want to uh make up for the fact that they have lost all their money through nfts that stuff is worthless so they're trying to sell ai art commissions in order to make back that money that they've lost basically people who want to take advantage of get rich quick schemes you know uh, it's like for photo editing, like, select the flower pot and flowers so I can move the flower pot. Oh, that's interesting. AI art commission sounds so troll. It's a thing, though. Like, it's a thing. You go to Pixiv and you are able to open requests for AI art commissions. It's disgusting. It's gross, it's disgusting, I hate it. But it's a thing. It's a natural thing. Like, what you even- Because <laughs> the thing is, these people are going to be pricing them dirt cheap. They're going to be pricing them, like, super, super cheap. So that they can... Basically be like, you can get this fully, like, detailed piece and all that. Simply by, um... Signing up. Uh, simply by paying me this much amount rather than paying maybe a couple hundred to this artist for this and you'll get it so much faster that's the type of mindset it is unfortunately and it's people who are like short on money but they want this art so badly and it's like you know what if i just pay pay this guy five dollars i basically get this artwork pro pretty much instantaneously it sucks but it's the case and i hate it so much because there's no soul in that art Hello, Mono. Sorry you had to join in on this tangent. <laughs> hi, hi. Ooh, I like that. It's a good tangent. Thank you. I know how to go on pretty good tangents. It's a thing. Like, sometimes I'll just start on a rant and then I just don't stop. It can be on any... Oh, thank you. Uh, literally just spent an entire semester talking and learning about it. Oh, that sucks. The thing is, I think, actually, no, maybe that might be for the best because I'm... I'm genuinely curious, what will this do for the video game industry? Because you can get multiple iterations of a design or... A, a, a character or anything you can get that so fast now and that's what sucks however the the one thing that it's gonna struggle with vtubers because vtubers are so reliant on being <sighs> hi elise it's so reliant on being cut up and layered but ai art can't do that yeah, it's strong in concept design because it can create so many iterations. You're just set with that and it's unfortunate. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mana. <laughs> no, that music is going to be okay for a while for a lot of reasons, definitely. Uh, it's terrible at creating exactly what you're looking for. Oh, definitely. But the thing is, they can very easily, like, make you like it can be a tool that they make you use in order to cut down your hours generate uh generate designs from these and adjust uh, as fit you have to basically work for less time you get paid for less hours pretty much unless you're working on commission rather than hourly i don't know it depends but i also see that as a way for them to like basically cut out the middleman bring a bunch of designs to an artist be like here this is what we like 
make something from this. It's... Uh, I don't see it going well. But... Stop going red. Fuck off. But uh, I feel like VTubing is the one area... Uh, I think so. It depends. Uh, but yeah, I feel like VTubing is like very, 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 it's going to be hard to ever like make, make that into like something that you can put into an AI and they will generate. Sure, they can come up with a design for you, but there's no way in hell they're going to actually be able to make that for you. That, the VTubing live 2D area as well is going to be super super difficult to actually have AI break into. It's not going to happen. Simply because at the moment AI will not know how to break down parts of an image. Unless they are like heavily, heavily fed these things. Even then, with designs, cutting the pieces is really, really difficult. VTubing's already kind of stretching how much distance you can put between you and your audience and still be able to connect with them. So making a, uh, making an AI is just not going to work at all. Oh no, no, no. Uh, by that I mean like uh, using AI art or AI generated illustrations to create a an actual VTuber model. Hi Sam. Ow. Hi Stan. Hello, I'm saying goodbye. Okay, good night. Ow. Hello. <laughs> uh, I like some of the AI voice synthesizers. Have you heard like... Uh, I've, I've seen like a lot of uh, Vocaloid programs actually like start to use AI and it, it's weird. The second bear just flew past. <laughs> Uh, okay, I needed to add some highlight here. I want to see if I can find some of the Vocaloid, uh, the Vocaloid AIs because I'm, they sound interesting because V6 is, hmm. Your little bro's drawing? Let's go. He's not digital, he got no tablet, the poor dude, and no PC search. I mean, to be fair, it's like... The $40 for a decent uh, drawing tablet? I've been saying this for a while now. Art only gains meaning because of the people who made it and people who experience it. So if you replace the former with a robot, then I do not give a single shit. I feel that. Because there is nothing better than unhinged... 3 a.m. scribbles from an artist who is fighting about six mental illnesses and just wants to vent <laughs> by torturing their OCs. My laptop uh, hates the HDMI connection to my tablet. Actually, annoying. E. Oh, I miss the. I I remember the days when I was using HDMI uh, to my laptop from my screen tablet. It was pain.
I very much do not miss the days of using an actual laptop. Uh, how many ports does your XP pen need to connect to your device? Uh, it has one power cable, one HDMI cable, and one input cable. So, three cables, basically. Well, two, uh, two to my computer and then one power supply cable. That's it, pretty much. It's amazing. Uh, I'm thinking of getting the 24. I'd say get the 20. Uh, I have the 24 Pro. But you'll want to... Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's how it is because, yeah, you need your, like, input cable. And then HDMI, unfortunately. Laptop hates the two to device. It's a, uh, one's a USB, just a heads up. But yeah, uh, that's fair. I mean, it might just be a laptop thing, like, or just device thing. I don't know. But I would, uh, oh, same as your Wacom. Mm hmm. You know, I'd be careful though, because I didn't read properly what mine was, and mine is not anti glare. Uh, so yeah, if you are going to get an XP pen, uh, careful which one you get. I have the Pro, and it's not anti-glare, but I think the, the E, or was it R? I, I forget which one it is. Uh, the E, I should wait, no, I have 22, 24, I don't know. But I know one of them is anti-glare. Most of them are anti-glare. Uh, Pro is the glass display? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. I didn't pay much attention. I just went for, like, whichever one was the best screen size for the best price. And, yeah, as a result, I went with this. I, I wish I had checked properly, you know, though. Because Wacom Pro is glass display like an iPad. Uh, let's find out. Generic Wacom is plastic screen. Let's see, the 24 QHD. Um... Blah, blah, blah. Uh... Oh, okay. Uh, so if you have a USB-C, uh, if you have a USB-C on your laptop, it's only one cable. It's only one cable if it's USB-C. Uh, what's the screen? I think it's, yeah, I think it might be the same distinction as the Pro, where... Oh, you have to have old no USB C match. Ah, rip. Uh, I think this is a glass screen anyway. I don't know how to tell though. Uh, Yeah, I don't see it. Well, at some point I'll need to also check out new tablets once this one starts dying. Which hopefully won't be anytime soon because I've only had this for like two years. And it's already been lasting me like really well. I've had no issues with it at, at all. And it it's amazing. <laughs> I don't want to lose this thing. It's It's so beautiful and it's so fucking expensive as well.
Yeah, I guess pro, the whole pro thing is, yeah, also like a Wacom distinction as well. So yeah, maybe the other, the non-pro versions. Uh... Alright, I was doing this. It's a bit too plastic -y. Uh, I don't know if I'd like the glass screen, so maybe I'll be saying by accident. Uh, the thing is, there are d different versions of the 24, so you can probably look into those. Like, there isn't just the pro version. At least I think there's other uh, other si uh, versions of the 24. Because typically they'll have the the regular version, the pro version, the and they they release the the E and R version. I don't know what those mean, but you know you can take a look. Because honestly, I. I highly recommend XP Pen as a whole, just because of how user-friendly they are, and how much more uh, affordable it is. And like, it's served me so well. The same with with uh, Huion. Though with Huion, I did have like minor issues with. Um, uh, just like one tiny minor issue. Um, what's it called? Like sometimes when I'd be drawing, my pen would basically do. Uh, it would do like that pattern for some reason, and I'd have to like unplug and replug my. Uh, my tablet and then that would fix it but it happened like a lot it was not fun cheaper than would be a whack but I can't find it oh, okay that's hmm. maybe they've not released it yet uh... I guess they only have the oh wait no what's this Oh, there we go. Yeah, 24. 24 large display. There, look at that. And yeah, also uses USB to USB C, uh, USB C to USB C. Uh. And yeah, if you get this one, you also like get a glove with it, which is spicy. I still have my glove that I got from them. It's, ah, it's so good. Yeah. 
You have a problem with gloves? Oh. Now I'm a freaking loser. I mean, I I always keep mine right next to my um my PC. It never leaves my room. If I leave my room, I keep my I put my glove next to it. But also, like I understand if you just forget to take it off and just take it with you, because I also do that. I did that once, and then I put it in my pocket, in my and then it went in the wash, and I didn't realize it went in the wash. I had a breakdown because I didn't know where it went because it's my beloved glove. I tried the other one, it didn't fit, and it oh, it didn't. It also didn't feel right because it didn't fit. Ugh, it was so not fun. Hi hi! Ooh, time for the horns, my favorite bit. I have officially terminated my apartment contract. Let's go! Yeah, I have tried out like a couple different brands uh, when it comes to graphics tablets. So if you have any advice, then I will happily give it you. Mm. Yeah, how you doing, Elise? How's your day been? Ah, this doesn't look right. Um... And I, I keep remembering that I need to book my COVID booster shot and I just keep fucking forgetting. Which isn't good because I am... Ugh, oh, yeah, 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 I am considered high risk and so I should probably get the shot, you know. Because, like, I, I have had my, like, my first boost but I haven't had my second. Or at least I haven't, like, subsequent year boosters. So, like, the whole thing with it, uh, the whole efficiency of it goes down. Booster shots are a thing I always forget, yeah. I mean, so do I, even though I should get them because my health. Almost died on the first shot, same. Like, oh god, it was a trip.
I remember that was like the first time I had ever felt like felt like what a fever is because I don't remember anything as bad as that. Uh, how many shots are you up to? I know a few people just uh, got their fourth. I yeah, 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 I'm due for my fourth, but my parents don't really want me to get it, but I probably should. Because I'm also in like a sticky situation where the AstraZeneca one, AstraZeneca one, I shouldn't get because the whole blood clot risk. Because like, uh, funny story about that actually. Uh, the day that they uh, actually like brought up the whole idea that AstraZeneca is causing this boost in uh, blood clots was the day I got my shot and so no one like was like oh you should not get this specific um uh shot so it wasn't until after where they were like wait why did you get this one I was like uh yeah it, it, funny story and they were like oh okay but no joke I have stopped playing oh god Game is like bad summers. <laughs> I'll be like that. I already know that I'm a disappointment. Oh no! <laughs> I'm sorry. I just judge because it, it's, it's so memed on because of how how much they put into advertising. I mean, I also wouldn't mind if they did sponsor me. You know. You're from Sweden. I love. Uh, I love to go there again. Just not Malmo. Okay, yeah, lighting is going to be hitting this one a bit different. That looks better. In one minute, then free. Let's go. You got this. I'm sorry that it's only Tuesday. <laughs> the sneeze does not want to leave my nose. Oh my god. <laughs> Itching to work on that. <laughs> Uh, 
<laughs> Ow. Break out the seats. I don't think that's how it works. Oh right, it was just messy. That's how I did the horns. It's just fucking messy. Should I need to do- oh god, same. I need to also actually finish off Rise of the Beast. Like, I think I've got everyone, all the beasts at like 100. Uh, I've got two at 120 and the other two at like 110 badges. And then I- oh, I- but the thing is I've not touched uh, Shenzhen. Uh, haven't done yeah I I mean it, it literally takes like what 30 minutes to grind out one of them maybe 45 I don't fucking know fuck that I really don't like Rise of the Beast because it's such it, it's more painful than, no that's a lie I was gonna say it's more painful than Guild Wars that's a fucking lie Oh yeah, we have Dread Barrage, whoa! Oh, hopefully Scottish uh, Wi-Fi or Scottish ping is good. Oh god, because I discovered that London ping versus my city's ping is so drastically different, it's unfunny. Sniffles. Hey, Diablo Four is coming out soon. Ooh, I've never played a Diablo game. Like, there's a lot of franchises where people say, oh, this game is coming out and I've not never played it just because I didn't get to play video games in my childhood much. I remember my parents tried to chase me away from liking video games and I was like, yeah, no, that's not happening. Great choice not to play it. Okay, I see. It's one of those games. Like, I'm, I've never played Half-Life, I've never play, played any of the Team Fortress games, I've, like, most games, like, most Valve games especially, that people are like, oh, my childhood, I've never played Portal as well, I've never played that. Uh, Call of Duty, I've never played either. 
I did actually no, that's a lie. I did try to play it, uh, but my I didn't know how to use like dual sticks at the time, so I sucked. And then I was like, I can't do this. I'm not playing. The fact that I haven't played Portal yet is kind of egregious. Uh, should play Portal and Portal Two will love. Oh, I know I'll love it because I I've seen like so many playthroughs of it, and I love Glados to bits. Do not play Half-Life? Oh god. Why? Because I'll be waiting for Half-Life 3 and just never get anything. <laughs> okay, yep, I hit the nail on the head. <laughs> oh, I see, I see. Uh, I'll play Half-Life Alex soon. Ooh! How fun! I don't have a VR headset so I can never play Half-Life Alex. I've also never played a Halo game. There's that too. Would be funny watching you and someone uh, try to figure out all Portal 2 puzzles together. The chaos duo you want for that is either me and Abby or me and Rain. Either way, it's not going to end up well because I'm going to be yelling at either one. <laughs> Which is the content we all want. Hell wants what is nice, everything after is meh, too bad. Ooh, I see. I love, I absolutely love rendering horns because it's so fun to like do this pattern. It's very much one of those where you need to trust the process and even I myself don't fully trust the process, but I should. Funny, uh, funny story about my my character, about my D and D character. Fun fact: she is hated by the gods. <laughs> and is married to a demigod, which is the, the most ironic bit. It's it's the greatest 
Uh, it's the cruelest joke you can have. It's the it's it's a cruel but ironic fate, and I I live for it. I know it's my gods in a way. <laughs> I mean, I don't think <laughs> even better plot twist. She's also a god. I mean, she has some interesting abilities and powers, so. I mean, she literally has the power to basically wipe people out of existence from, like, ever existing. Kind of like, uh, the whole ReZero thing. What happened there? She can basically do that. Yeah. <laughs> and yet she's hated by the gods, I wonder why. <laughs> The big ripperoni. <laughs> but I, I am very, very curious what the post, what the epilogue will hold, hold essentially. <laughs> Like, what happens after the final boss? What... What happens to her? It's... Oh, I can't wait. Ooh, I do like this horn pack pattern. It's true what they say, a good piece of art can really change I hope that they release custom flutes, even if it, they're not like actual instruments. I just hope that Nintendo releases them, because I so badly want them. And if not, one day I will save up for a custom wooden. Maybe I don't know. We'll see. I do want to pick up more instruments, and piano is one that I really want to uh, go back to. Piano and flute. I want flute. And flute so bad from Game Award. Yeah! His. Oh, I want. I hope. Nintendo could make so much money if they just release that, but also you know, scalpers. We saw what happened. It will also crash their website again. The thing is, they also could have had it as like a pre-order bonus, as like, not even like a proper instrument, but it could have very easily just been uh, like a decoration piece. I would have still taken that. My brother hates flutes with a passion after having learned to play. I, oh god, so I had to learn to play one, and I what I hate more than flutes is broken flutes. It's a pain to play, but it's even more of a pain when they don't even work right because it's the it's the school owned flute. And as a result, the 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 plates don't press down properly. And that's why guessing a keyboard is probably my best bet. 
because recorder is too much of a meme instrument at the moment. Buy recorder and flute and do the Titanic song remake. <laughs> Fun fact, I, I learnt music through learning a recorder. Ow. That made me jump. Yeah. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> okay, there we go. This piece is looking spicy. Mm -hmm. Pega Rain! This song is also from Xenoblade 2. <laughs> it is called um, Bringer of Chaos Ultimate. <laughs> Did they steal that riff from Pokemon? Which Pokemon? Because this came out five years ago. Where I just got hair and she's already making fun of me. <laughs> Bruh. Ah! Oh yeah, you can use your bits. <laughs> it's, it's so weird to hear not channel point uh, sound alerts. Because there's such a big variety. <laughs> Okay, what do I colour next? Oh right, I need to add some shine to her face, mainly add her lips. There are so many layers. <laughs> I'll be drawing my own funny. Let's go. I can't wait. Also, if you're curious as to how I do my horns rain, it's literally just scribbles. This is literally just the scribbles. <laughs> Legs in the box. Let's go. Did you manage to fix the horns? messy just works those two. yeah if you need advice on those then yeah let me know hit me up <laughs> from like gentle pokemon i can't remember the exact song oh uh, first one, I don't know many Pokemon tracks or where it would come from. My my brain goes to Victory, uh, Victory Road, the one that was in Smash Brothers. Let me check the comments. Maybe they'll see. No. Nah, there's nothing. Holy! Arrows are! Thank you for the raid! Hello! Uh, what's the. Uh, fucking. Uh. uh. There we go! Woo! 
Hello! Hello, Aros! Thank you so much for the raid! Welcome, raiders! How are you? I see you are uh, drawing. <laughs> I see you are drawing. Feel free to uh, send uh, your, uh, whatever you are drawing or like any... Um, what am I trying to say? B -b 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 like any drawing uh, that you want in chat. Thank god you will not get bonked because I like to just manage the links myself. Oh, looking lovely. Thank you. Thank you. It is my D&D uh, &D character. <laughs> Thanks, Elise. It's my D&D &D character from a campaign I am playing. Uh, her name is Galda. She is a half dragonborn. Uh, and she has some... Ow. Some interesting... Uh, she's in a bit of an interesting situation. Yeah, how was your stream? How was it? I hope it was great. <laughs> it was good, got uh, a bunch of comms sketch, so it was productive. Let's go! Yeah, if you want to share some art, feel free to do so. Uh, all you guys in chat, uh, fucking check out Aros. This is a threat. <laughs> Sorry, Rain. Yeah, if you feel the need uh, to go rest up or anything, if it's late, you want to go get something to eat, feel free to do so. <laughs> the god powers threat, yes. There we go, that looks a bit better. Mm. <laughs> I don't know what we're going to do now. Find out. <laughs> okay, what do I need to? Okay, so I think it's just the clothing left, right? I've done most like the body, uh, pretty much. I could probably add like a slight gradient onto here, but also I feel like it's fine as it is now. Probably do the necklace actually. The necklace is probably just a quick and easy. <laughs> Color picker, my best friend. I remember seeing the artwork somewhere, but so far I love it. <laughs> Thank you. Why does my- I don't know why, but for some reason my connection keeps going into like orange slash red and I keep dropping frames. I don't know how, but I've dropped about like- I've apparently dropped a lot of frames more than my fucking Genshin stream, which is baffling. <laughs> Hopefully it's not affecting stream too much. Skill issue. Shut the fuck up, Rain. Shut the fuck up. No one asked. I'm gonna beat you. <laughs> this is why you're adopted. As if, okay, thank god. Like, so long as it's not actually interrupting. Watch your profanity. Okay. <laughs> I 
okay, so long as I'm not like actually like causing buffering or stuttering, I'll take that. You go with that, yeah. I'd wanted to start this for a split second, but not okay, thank god. As long as like there's no like full destruction to stream or my stream just fucking dies because I don't know why, but for some reason occasionally OBS likes to die. Uh fire. I, I swear I had like some sort of fire texture. Yes I do. Because here we take advantage of uh, assets in the Clip Studio store. Nope, that's the wrong button. So far it's been okay on my end, just model desyncing for like- Oh yeah, that's definitely like a- Like fire gold. <laughs> uh, where is? I need to shrink this a lot more. I see. Drink it a bit more. And then I add like a overlay to it or something. There we go. I oh, just need to actually adjust the colours. Uh, I'm too depressed or espresso for homework, but it's already 12 hour late. Uh, and it needs to be in before tomorrow's group work. Give me power. You can do this, Elise! I believe in you. You can do this. Oh my god. You, I believe in you. I very much believe in you. You have the power of god and anime on your side. Homework, you don't need to do the drawing. <laughs> yeah, take all the energy here. I'm sure there's plenty here who will offer you energy to help finish this assignment because Jesus. The drawing is the only productive thing I can do right now. Oh no, rain. Why homework when can paint instead? <laughs> I stayed up three hours last night just frozen trying to- st Oh no. Oh, it's- We all have those days. We all- All have those days. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Okay, that looks better. Uh... You can do this, Elise. I believe in you. Just keep cracking at it. <laughs> yeah, be better than... I don't want to be mean. That's fucking mean. That 
looks very... No, oh, it does... Hmm. I guess I'll go with that then. Yeah, you can't see it anyway. Uh, I've been staring at it since noon, between lots of procrastinating gameplay. <laughs> I don't want to be shut, your, shut up being mean as your whole personality. Fuck you. What do you mean as my whole personality? I'll beat your fucking ass. Bruh. Being mean as my whole personality. Fuck you. <laughs> you want mean? I'll show you mean. Watch your profanity. <laughs> you know what? Maybe the bits weren't so much of a waste, huh? Maybe you being Papega has a good outcome. <laughs> Women's personality is being adorable and my good girl. Listen, the first bit is true, but you can call me the second bit again as many times as you want. Should have gotten a bit sooner. Yeah, exactly. You can bully me. <laughs> <What's next? laughs> it's fine, I can say it. Appy's not here. <laughs> I'm just upset that you're getting special treatment. <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, rip a rip a lease, rip rain. <laughs> She's hitting me and my mommy is just helpless. <laughs> nah, I feel like you should take the L. Okay, you you walked into this. You cannot leave. Yeah, you done that to yourself, Ren. You wanted the special treatment, you got the special treatment. Okay, what comes next? Belt buckle. That's small, I can do that. <laughs> Last time you make a joke. <laughs> I'm sorry for all any raiders who who are uh, sticking around for this. This isn't how it normally is. So the face of my character has every color of the rainbow. Am I? Uh, depends on the lighting, because uh, depending on the lighting, yeah. It is way. We're in on my good little cuties. Let's go! I mean, this is. <laughs> I mean, Elise is always Elise, but it's never this bad. It's only when Sam's not here that she's fully unsupervised. can't tell what gender they are, so... Let's go! Sam keeps her in check, pretty much. There we go. And then add like a little bit of an effect with a red colour, because red highlights are really cool. <laughs> I 
Now I am procrastinating, so I am even worse than when I am only unsupervised. Oh no. Oh no, Elise, Elise, you need to do your assignment. Please need to find Elisa's soft spot so we can get her to work. Do it for your cats. Even if they are ankle biters, do it for your cats. Do it for me, Elise. Pretty please. I care. <laughs> this is how you get her. Oh, what do you mean? There's all these. Oh god, there's all these layers. I still need to. Oh god, a lot more than I remember. Oh, you're gonna go focus? Yeah, that's that's fair. Bye bye. I think I'm gonna post my progress over on Twitter. Cause I am dead proud with how this is looking. I can't wait to see it though, you. I have this I can I can make some damages happen. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> I'm that proud of how you are looking. <laughs> Grimmy! How dare you? <laughs> hey, there we go. Posted. <laughs> yeah, at least, oh god, yeah, at least can't hurt you. And she, 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 it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. I, I love the um, emotional manipulation going on in chat. You love to see it, huh? You love to see it. Are you turning me against me? At least you need to work on your stuff. Come on. Thank you very much. I, it has, oh god, internet please, internet please, internet please, internet please.
internet was gonna fucking kill itself there. Alright, so. I have done a fair bit of drawing progress today. And I think it's about that time where I call it a day. Maybe you can go ahead and finish your stuff, Elise. <laughs> uh, anyway. Thank you everyone who came out for today's stream. Thank you everyone who stuck around from Aris's raid. If you haven't checked them out already, please do. Uh... Please, please go check them out. Give them a follow. You stream for background sound? Yeah, don't worry. I will send you to another stream. Plus, I, ne I need to hop off. My wrist is kind of hurting a bit. I'm sorry. Uh, please, please stick around for the raid. Show them some love in the chat. Maybe drop them a follow. All that good stuff. And uh, if you don't know me, I stream every day except Wednesdays and Saturdays. Except for this Saturday. Uh, except for... the this weekend which is an exception because i will be away but i won't also be streaming i won't be streaming tomorrow either <laughs> i'll be back on thursday i'll be back on thursday and friday for my regular streams then and then a weekend away uh oh god don't phone don't die on me uh ba -ba 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 -ba. thank you thank you everyone and i'll see you guys on thursday oh god i didn't put in the there we go Bada bing, bada boom. Bye bye.